sense, if, even if you, if you have glasses, that you can uh, prove by yourself. Well, I, when I'm uh, trying to, to get the password from, from outside to the, to the user, not from inside the computer, from, from inside the system, uh, the, the first thing was, okay, I'm, I'm not good on typing, so I don't know if you are good on typing. I, I used to type like two fingers, no, not two fingers, maybe four fingers. Uh, but the professional is not a great difference because between 50 and 90 words per minute, it not, it's not, it's so much. But with a good camera, you can take it, the, the, the video, and take the what what he's typing. Okay, the time goes by, but people uh, used to type their passport in front of the other of the others. If you go to an office at 9 a.m. or 10 a.m., everybody's going to the, their system and logging in, and they put their password. They're, they're, they are not doing like this. It's, it's, not, it's, not, it's not common. You, you go and you put the password, and you get the, the mobile phone and you put the password. It, it's, it's very common to put the password. So uh, if nobody is watching at you, you are not suspecting of everything in, in life. Okay? Maybe maybe the commercial security, yes, but it's not so common. So. <coughs> I tried to, to make a twist to a, a very old technique that, is, that was based on just looking when you put a password. And that, that's, that was a technique, a real technique. And it, it, uh, instead of uh, on trying to, to get into the network, into the TCP, and take the, 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 the sequence number, and then high shack, and, or put a keylogger with the malware, okay, let's go uh, in the other side. And I tried to, to, to see what I put. Well, the, the, the problem is you have one shot. You, you have to have a lot of memory, but you, now nowadays you have a, a very good technology like mobile phones and cameras, etc. So that's very simple. That's a iPhone's friend. This is a, a camera of the iPhone. This is a tiny mirror that I, I'm, I'm holding with the with the finger. And okay, I don't know my, my name, but I just bite. Um, yeah, it was a problem here in India. It's, this is my third week in India. I, I'm tired of coughing, getting fever, and vomiting. Well, okay, that's it. Okay, What's, how was the technique in a nutshell? The first, the first step is, of course, stand near the, the, the person who's typing the password. So maybe a meter or meter and a half, no more, much more like this. Uh, then, of course, you point the keyboard with the mirror. I, I will show you that. And then <coughs> you record a video, small video, maybe seven, ten second video is very short. And of course you have to process and analyze it. This is the where the magic happens. And you get the password. So you have the, uh, this kind of stuff that I I don't know if, if I combine. Oh. Yeah maybe you can you know, I pass you you pass the other one. This is a small, a tiny periscope that I got in eBay or Dilextreme that you put here in the in, in the mobile, and it's, it's, you have not, it's not necessary to, to be in front or the side of, of, of taking the the, the the mirror. So you pass the this one, and there's a you have, you can be helped with a tiny lens, a two tiny lens, maybe if you if you want to to go further in the, with the technique. So, pass the through the bottom to, to the audience. So, um, when you have this, it's very simple. You see, that, that's a, just an image. When you start moving the, 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 the mirror manually, you, you start to see this, this line. And of course, here's the, the line that divides what you're seeing with the mirror and without the mirror. And to analyze that, I had three approaches. The first one is uh, an independent processing. You have the video and you, you step in the two fr into frames, and you, you see. Then the, my, my preferred technique, that's the direct video processing, that is with the, with the software, and then the automated processing that is, is far from my, from my knowledge by so far. Okay, the first one is uh, the frame extraction. You have the video, you can get some software, some free software like FFmpeg, and get frame by frame, and you, have, you, you get all the images. Then you process, because you have one image, make it, you, you rotate, you flip, etc. You have to do that with all the images. So you have to bad process processing, like 
uh, software free software, open software, free software like uh, Ethereum View, and then you you do it the last part with your eye. Suppose that you you got all the the frames, you have the original frame, then you you can rotate because maybe I, I'm taking the, the image in this side, or maybe maybe in this side, maybe you are sitting here and I, I'm there, so I'm taking the image, maybe flip it and and and. and Maybe uh, rotated, so I have to, to correct that to read the to, to make the the, the, analy the analysis, and then you mirror, of course, because you took the you took the image with the mirror, and then you do the same thing with a batch processor like uh, the from here from view has a has a, a very good uh, batch processor engine, uh, so you you do do that with all this stuff, okay, no problem, and the basic analysis, is, of course. Try to identify some key. What was the, the maybe two, three, four images that correspond to one key? Maybe the, when when it when it pressing, when it's not pressing, it, it's not uh, it not it's not so trivial to get the key, of course, because the, the hands are always moving. It's not like a piano player that is very clear. When we type, we, we do like that. It's, it's very it's strange. Then you can isolate the keys, so you can. Uh, they see the, the difference and the, the, the movement, and you, you can switch from the key from the, to, to the other and see the, the, the small movement, and of course you guess the key. So, uh, it's, it's okay so far, so far so good. Okay. Uh, so let's see a, a study case with an iPhone 5 with a normal typing uh, uh, at like the normal velocity. And indoor light is not a very, very good condition, and normal typing is normal, it's not a, a very fast. Here, look, that, that's the, 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 the zone that I'm zooming in. So I, that, that's, that's the important part. I, that, that's, there's no keys in that side that the, the guy will, will, will press. So I right, uh, reduce, reduce the entropy. Uh, and I put some uh, with the Excel or some, some little paint. I, I paint, painted all the, the keys over the, the, the keyboard, the, the, the picture. And look at this. And this is Two images, one one and, and the, the next one. Look, I have not more resolution for from one to another one. But if you get that moment in each key, you probably are very close to to guess the key. So, oh sorry, uh, can you see the the present key? Which which key? E. The P. It's pressing the P because it's, it's down. Yeah. The, the, in the other side of the other finger. That's if you if you start to to practice, it's, uh, and maybe in a, a week, it's very very easy. But at the first time, it's uh, just crossing the fingers. It's, it's not so trivial. So you can get some tips, like a, get a transfer a keyboard and, and, and put it like that, and watch the previous movement because we, when you press the key, we, we first uh, like lift the the finger to, to like a. To make uh, some pressure in the opposite in the opposite side, and then you press. So that does uh, you have to understand the movement of the hands. If you play piano, it's very common to, to, to analyze that movement of the key of the of the fingers, and you have to consider and uh, alter the shifted key, of course. If you if you don't get uh, enough key, it's no problem because if you, if you try to uh, to guess just words or passwords that maybe are related to the person. Maybe if you have the, a half of information, there's no problem. You, you can guess the rest. You can all you can read this, and you have uh, just uh, seventy percent of the information. And the last one is real. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so my favorite one, of course, is the the, the direct by video processing. That is, I, I will show you with the software. I choose a. Uh, an open source software named Kinovia that is used to, to motion tracking in sports like that, the, 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 the man lifting the weight and maybe in soccer or rugby when you, you kick the, the, the ball and there's a, a, a tracking of the ball or you're in the, the offside of the players. I don't know if it's in cricket it's used, but I think so, but it's, it's really, really useful and it's free. So it's very powerful. Sorry because of the screenshot, all in, all in Spanish, but it's no problem because it's, it's easy. So that's the, that's the program I will show you in a, in a while. Uh, I, I got the, the video from a friend typing a normal speed. 
um, you can do all of, uh, all, all of the, the, the techniques I said before. You can get na you, you can do it now uh, on, on in real time. Okay, mm -hmm. maybe in the, while the video is is, is playing, you can uh, editing. It's very impressive, very good. We, you, you don't uh, have to to extract the images and, and and process the images. I will show you. So that's you can you can flip it. You can flip it directly from the video, and then you you, you save the video in, in a flip it, uh, in a flip it way. Here, <coughs> you can import and export and, and make subsets of images. You can <coughs> also get uh, automated levels of colors and contrast. That's in the past, uh, it's, a, it's a good help to, to analyze that that's automatic levels and contrast and uh, like shapes, uh, etc. You can also draw a grid from the program. You, you, can, you can put a grid. Uh, that's to, to simulate uh, the 2D over, or 3D over 2D because you are, you are watching an image, but this is 3D, so you can put a degree and to, to make a, uh, like a, a reference. That's another, uh, another image. And the, maybe the, the best uh, the feature of the program is that you can put a point in any part of the body if, if you have a very good resolution uh, video is much better, of course. And then the program, uh, the, the software itself, it, it will be tracking the, that point in, in, in function of all the, the, the environment. It try to, to, to say, okay, this point is different from this point, so it, when, when it moves uh, this side, I follow the point. So it draws all the track, the path, okay? That's very difficult when you with, with have uh, low resolution. So uh, you have to correct frame by frame. You are you, you will be correcting that movement that you put. You, you, you move this point. Oh, no, this is not the finger. This is a crossed finger. You you, you uh, that, that 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 was wrong. So put it in, in, in maybe in the two millimeters uh, in the side. So it's a very um, like a handicraft uh, work. That's that's the, the one one path all put in the, this finger and that's the main that is in the, in the square is the, the, the main finger or the, the main track point uh, is in the is here so the software is very very easy to use it's like paintbrush that's uh, another another example I, I what I did uh, was uh, took one snapshot in each when, when I thought that the, the key was present I took one snapshot so I can analyze it later so that's very clear. Look at this. That's very, very, very clear. The, the, maybe when, when you have one finger, it's very clear. When you have all the fingers, it's very difficult because the fingers do like this. Uh, and you, of course, uh, can see the the time, the the pixel. If you if you have a two D grid, grid, um, maybe you can put one point in. If you are not moving so much the the, the, the camera, or the video. Uh, if, if you have pixels. You can put those, those uh, points, so then you can try to, to organize that in a timeline. And you have password, of course. Is the, the, the periscope going around? Uh, then the, the program uh, automatically can export that to an XML file, and then you can put another column with the time, so you, you can. Help, help yourself by analyzing that, and software is very good to, to do that. But that's, that, that I, I thought that there was the first uh, uh, the first approach to automate, uh, automatize the, the technique, but it was not pos possible because the grid is not the same always. Because maybe your keyboard is like this or like this or like this or, or is in another position, so it is not possible to to say okay, here is the K and this this zone of pixels are the, that are the key because it's not it's not the same in all videos. But if you can uh, arrange the video, it, it will be good. Okay, so let's see a, a video, an, an edited video. That 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 same video. Let's open the Kinovia. Sorry for the interface, in Spanish interface. <coughs> Resolution quote um, <coughs> because I, I, I took 
with the, with the, the, the cell phone in this side uh, because it was uh, like a real representation of the real world in the wild that I'm not trying to do like this over the keyboard if not, it, it was no, no useful the technique and I can do uh, with this like zoom in to the, to the part I really I'm really interested in the maximum is uh, six hundred percent zoom. So that the maximum. That's it. And I can do a frame by frame with the sorry. That's it. Like frame by frame with the scroll in the mouse. You can go like this. That's it. And that's the first movement. Of course, the program doesn't know that that's the first movement. I have to, to, to say, okay, track this finger, fingertip. That's it. And, and I can continue doing that. Or just look at this. It's just a five, almost five seconds video. You can watch it hundreds of times until you get the password. Okay. We will uh, play the video and you tell me. Uh, Oh, it's, it's, it's very fast, but we, we can slow it down in real time. That's very good. You can slow down the video in real time, so you have no, no need to editing and exporting and using Adobe Premiere. Okay. Can you see or can you guess the password? That's it. Very, very, very easy. That's it. And it is not so complicated if you get some practice. Well, that's it. Um, uh, that, that video was flipped and rotated, etc. Doing that. And the other video is, is almost the same but uh, has a difference because it's not a keyboard. It's my friend or a college in the university uh, putting a password in the mobile phone. It's a, it's a real distance, maybe almost two meters. You, you, you may see the, the distance. If I am here, I, I make some cuts because he, he, at first he typed it wrong, so we can make it again and again. And if you put like this, that's normal. It's, it's normal, but if you go, it's very, very easy to take it. Of course, you have to, to, if you have a very good video, very good camera, that, that's the beginning of the technique because the cameras are, in, from this moment on, will be growing and growing and growing the resolution. And maybe two years ago, this, this was not possible because of the, 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 the quality of the cameras. I tried this, this technique since uh, two or three years ago. It was impossible with my library, it's <laughs> not possible. And then, I am, from iPhone 4 and Samsung Galaxy S3 and uh, that, that kind of phones, uh, the, the new generation, it was possible to do, it, to do that. So that, that's all. Um, let's continue. Uh -huh. Well, so if you can uh, go to an auto automatic processing, you it was. It would be very good, but it, I think it is still very difficult. I really tried to do it. I contacted contacted some uh, Indian programmers that I think that are the best programmers in the world are here in India. I contacted them to, to, to get some help. They gave me some help, but it was no not enough. So if you have some ideas, it, the, the research is open to you. Uh, so maybe you can get, get the 3D modeling of the hands and the, the, the keyboard. Is, there's a lot of models of 3D models available online for, for downloading uh, for free. And you can use technique of motion estimation from 3D over 2D. There's all, all studied, a lot of, lot of papers and a lot of stuff of uh, graphic design on that. So that's, that's no problem. And there's a lot of um, uh, papers and studies about physical engines from Angry Birds to uh, every game is using a physical engine, so you can do some motion tracking and collision detection uh, because maybe when you uh, you can calculate when the, the, the if, you, if you have two surfaces 
you can automatically calculate what the, what the surface is, is touching uh, between them. So if you have an engine, it's very, very easy to do. And of course, it's, it would be great to have a Python script that solves everything. Uh, we, we used to, uh, to, to look for that. Uh, there, there, there should be, uh, in the Python standard, standard library, there should be a, a, a function or I don't know. But that's it. All in all, uh, I really like to, to watch uh, back to all techniques because we, we always try to, to go further and deeper and deeper and deeper and the, the, the technology and technical and cryptography and, and protocols and that's good, it's very good but uh, the problem is uh, in, if, you, if you take the big picture of privacy that's a really, 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 really big deal in, in trying to, to understand how we do things and how we put our password as is our own privacy if, if I get the password, I get you that's it. Uh, right? There's a lot of uh, control measures, etc. But it's really, really important to, to take care of that. So I, you can practice that from now. From now, maybe you can get a, you, you have to get a, a tiny mirror, but that, that's it. In an hour, you can be sniffing, <laughs> eye sniffing password to your friends. Uh, so that, that was a very complicated, that was very complicated in the, the last eco party, that's last, um, even event in Buenos Aires that everybody after the, the talk everybody was putting this password like this it was yeah, because of me uh, and of course you can do it in a lot of applications maybe in, in, in locks electronic locks mobiles and everything that you have to put something something that you know that is the, the first the main uh, way of authentication so that's it uh, I hope you enjoyed that and thank you very much.